Speaking of kayaks. Those are cool. It's a book. So like you can Stickers. if you have these, you can put it they're for windows, like the vinyl. Oh, okay. These are for, cute. for decoration yeah. decorating your windows. And that's because that's what I'm always it's cute. It's a good idea. Camping expedition tonight. Said for their camping expedition tonight. That looks cool. Is it coming apart? You said. Oh, 
Okay. Yeah, glue. darn, that would have been. You could re glue that. Over. Yeah. Nope. So my plan is since I can't take pictures of clothes real well, if I pick up some clothing, I'm going to just draft them. Mm -hmm. And then as soon as I've got space available to take pictures and list them, I will. You want to double check me on this one? I don't see any stains, but doesn't mean I missed it. Yeah, just dis discolorations or anything. That's what I thought. Yes, ma'am. Tags tipped it out of it though. Bingo, bingo, bingo. That's still new with tags. Don't know if this will be a half off forever for them, but I'm grabbing it and running. OGO is one of my favorite brands for sporting goods.
All right, we got a late start today. Uh, and there's a big community yard sale that we go to every uh, week. Not every week, every year. And uh, this is the first time I've been here. The property of Mr. Bob Shanks, who was the owner of Happy Burger Restaurants here in Logan Sport. And uh, they've sold those, and then they had to shut down. Um, one got sold to a Japanese type style restaurant and the other one got sold where they kept up the business as he did for what year or two not even, not even. and uh, then they shut it down so all the stores are all the happy burger restaurants are now closed and or still the one on the west side of town is still operating uh, as a Japanese steakhouse basically and uh, yeah this was this is his property his family's throwing in for this yard sale and we got a good deal that everything was half off that ogo bag was only seven dollars and it should sell for around 30. and the other items so a total of eleven dollars a nike jacket that i didn't look the comps up on it i just grabbed it because uh it's vintage it's got a sports color uh block coloring to it real nice look like it was in excellent condition um, I'm thinking that one should be the 30 to 40 dollar range but we'll uh, comp it out later a little more scenery here as we're leaving the Shanks property uh, I didn't know he had John Deere collectibles he's he, he was huge in coca-cola and is Bob still with us or did he pass I'm not sure. No, I think he might still be with us. Anyway, they had a big sale and they sold a lot of his Coke uh, memorabilia collectibles off at that time. I don't know if we can see it. This pond over here with the bridge and the boat right there. I'll try to zoom in. Oh, I missed it. The boat right there has a. The boat, he used to always have like a, a monkey. So it was a mannequin. I thought at one point though, I think he had a mannequin type monkey or a fake monkey out there, but always waving to the traffic going by. So just a nice, real nice property out here as we head into, this is a town of Royal Center that we're heading off to, community sales. Except we got a real late start. It's almost 12 o'clock right now. So we're just gonna hit a few and uh, try to get some things done today after we get home, get the yard work done, caught up and go from there. That's cool. Handmade. Be a good Etsy. Couple of good Etsy items there. Or something, prayer cards. They're prayer cards. Man, what a weight off. Oh, what's that? That release is great. Got to dig through the piles. You never know what you might find. Seriously soft. Thank you. 
And now that Mossy Oak established 1986, that's the year I graduated, showing my age. Got a couple of dings on it. Never opened. One dollar. I have not had any luck selling those. Monopoly started theming everything and now they're just not as desirable. At least I don't see it. It's like a lunch bag. Here Bradley. Eight dollars I want. Sports pack here. Blue Laroe, yeah. Not Blue Women. Your Bradley lunch bag there, honey. It's mostly kids' clothes there. Got some hats. Four dollars for a Colts hat, not happening. Five dollars for a what Boston's Bruins? Oh, there's a Jaguar. That one may I don't want to pay five bucks for it, but sentimental reasons. All football hats. Are these all kid sizes? Yeah. Toddler. So yeah, not worth it for that. If they were adult size, I'd see if they would uh, make a deal. Might have been buying them as collectibles. So no, we're gonna pass on those. These are not gonna be the right size. But my she wants. I'm not seeing much. We got a puff coat over here. We'll go look at it. And jacket. It's from the Gap. Mall brand. Yes, Polo. I have to look that one up. Pull Association 2XLL.
All right, we uh, got a late start, not till what, 11.30 or something like that, 12 o'clock, but we stopped at three sales, and the back end is loaded. We got some extra stuff back there, some water bottles we gotta fill, but for the most part, the back end is filled up. Uh, found some neat deals today, and uh, got, Miss B got some stuff for her kid, kiddos, and possibly for our niece and uh, my uh, stepsister to work on their little projects together as well. So all in all, short but very good outing to the community yard sale. Sorry to cut off there. Uh, another Georgia Tech jersey, uh, Russell brand, authentic leather, or rubberized, I'm sorry, Nintendo 3DS carrier. Got it for like 25 cents or something like that. Uh, can't pass up the golf stuff. Callaway shorts, new with tags. A couple bucks on those. Should sell 15 to 20. Um, the rest of this, these three boxes here, where I don't know how well they're going to do. I really don't. Uh, Christian stuff may take a while to sell. Maybe slow sell-through rate. But these are all t-shirts that were part of somebody's ministry. Uh, so this is an adult large uh, these may be a lot of adult large. There's a medium. Are you ready? Um, my life was saved by a blood donor and Jesus. So those are mediums. So I just got a whole bunch of these in here. I'll have to go through them, see if any of them need, you know, a little cleaning like this one's got some, some stuff on it. May not be able to sell that one. Uh, but it's different sizes, adult sizes in here and kid sizes over here. Youth sizes. So, you know, we're hoping for a little volume right there. And, uh, you know, if there's 10 of one and eight of another and six of another, whatever, uh, it works out. But we'll be able to do this in a volume type situation. And I don't know, I'm hoping to get, you know, if we go ahead and put them on. Some of these may be donated to some of our church, of our, our own church um, activities as well. So if I put them on eBay, you know, three, four, I'll say Four ninety nine, four ninety four, a shirt or something like that. Youth shirts, maybe, because I got them for I got them all for ten dollars. All right, so that's gonna wrap up our wrap up for the day. Thanks for tuning in. Hopefully, I can get this whole video up and running by Monday, and we will talk to you again soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Let's go make some money.